Welcome. This is Daniel Boati. Today we are going to look at G major chords. We are going to look at the various positions you can play G major chords on the fretboard. Let us begin from the neck here. We come to the middle and then for this far end. You already know, or if perhaps you don't know, the third fret on the E string one, two, three is G. You can put your third finger here, put your third finger there. The second finger is placed on the second fret of the A string here. That is B. This is B. Good. Then your fourth finger is placed at the third fret of the little E string. So with this shape, you have something like this. Then you play. Don't worry, at the initial stages you may find some difficulties, but don't worry, continue, you will get everything. This same position, some people place their first finger at the second fret of the B string, of the A string here, the B, and then they place their second finger on the third fret of the G string like this and then their third finger is placed at the, the their third finger is placed at the third fret of the little E here so some people also play it like this Apart from that, we are still at the third fret. We can use a bar chord. Bar the third fret of the guitar here, the third fret with your first finger. Okay. Then your third finger is placed at the fifth fret of the A string. So if this is G, this is D. Then your second thing, your 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 third finger is placed at the D here. Your second finger is placed at the fourth fret of the G string, that is B. Then your little finger is placed at the fifth fret of this D string. This is G. Okay then you play everything you play everything like this this is also G major or let's play it halfway bring your third bring your your third finger at the fifth fret of the D string your third finger is here this is G. Mm? Your second finger is placed at the fourth fret, the fourth fret of the G string. This is B. Then your first finger bar the third fret of the B string and the E string here like this. Okay. So your first finger, your second finger, then your third finger. You have something like this. This is very similar to the F and then the other keys okay. very similar good this is G major we can also get a G at the eighth fret the eighth fret of the B the eighth fret of the B string you have G here okay 
and then the tenth fret of the E um, the 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 tenth fret of the E string here is also G. So so put your second finger here. Put your second finger at the eighth fret of the B string. Your first finger at the seventh fret of the G string. Your third finger at the mm, ninth fret of the D string, and then your fourth finger at the tenth fret of the A string. This is very similar to the F major we played yesterday. So it is like this. It is like this. Okay. You can see that you are hearing the me here. It means that I have bar uh, this. I have bar this one, two, three. Okay. And okay. So this is also G. Now at the tenth fret, you can come to the twelfth fret. Come to the twelfth fret. The twelfth fret, you are going to bar the D, the G. And then the B with your third finger like this. Mm. Then your first finger holds the G, G at the tenth fret. Okay, so you play. You have G major like this. I have taught you the other alternatives yesterday. Yeah, yesterday, uh, like this. But because of this acoustic, uh, I may find it difficult to <laughs> play it. The other opportunities okay good I have, I have played good you can also bar with your first finger the d the g and then the b here with your first finger and then play you have a g mm. then you can add uh, your your second finger to the 14th fret of the a string and then your fourth finger at the 15th fret of the E string so that you get something like this the acoustic body is very big so I find it difficult apart from this you can come to come to uh, Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. At the seventeenth fret, seventeenth fret of the D string is G. Sixteenth fret of the G string is B, and then um, fifteenth fret of the little B, the B, and then the E string. We have D and then G. So you have another shape like this. Okay, let me play all of them for you. The first, the same position, you can hold it like this. Or you can bar it like this. You can play it halfway like this. Come to the 8th fret, 8, 9, 10, 11, 8, 9, 10. So, 8, 9, 10. Okay. Something like this. Come to the 12th fret. Or oh, this. Or oh, this. Oh, forgive me. Very difficult to play with the acoustic. <laughs> okay, you can hold it like this. Or oh, you can come to the 15, 16, the 17th fret. 15, 16, 17 fret to play it like this. So, as I've been telling you, you may have some difficulties in playing them, but don't worry. Continue the good practice. In no time, you get everything at your fingertips. Meet you next time for another lesson.
Thank you.